Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm Marisa Collison. Today's episode is all about coffee. episodes that we're going to be doing on outdoor coffee methods. We do what? enjoy the, the dark timber packets. They're really great and when you're backpacking and you are um, really wanting to cut down on the amount of equipment and weight that you bring, uh, dark timber is amazing. You just pour it in water and you're good to go. However, we want to expand our um, methods of making coffee with different products, different types of coffee, different styles. And see what works, what doesn't work, and what tastes great, what doesn't taste great. This is mocha pot style coffee. It is basically a mix or a, kind of a hybrid of espresso and percolated coffee. It's not quite espresso, not quite percolated. Um, you heat up the water, percolates through here, and this is basically a like creates a, a little espresso puck and shoots up through here and comes out, percolates out of there. Um, I have never made coffee like this outdoors before. Have I? I've never made it outdoors. I make it at home every day. Sometimes two or three times a day. It's not actual espresso because not enough pressure builds up to create that pour that comes out of a special shots. Um, when you grind this, we've already pre-ground it at home. It is not quite an espresso grind, but is not quite a drip grind. Okay, sorry, I'm talking a lot. Okay, so we are pouring water into here, below the pressure valve. Set in your screen. I've got little bits of salt crystals in there. It enhances the flavor of the coffee and is not salty. You don't quite want to, that sounds like it's uh, running out of steam. Probably is. Oh man, that'd be really sad. <laughs> and he put it out. Um, pull it off to the side a little bit. It's gonna give some air. There you go. Sorry, that's, I didn't bring the little pot stand for it. So, How come? Because I don't actually have it. Oh, because the milk, the It's made MSR. to just cook in the cup. Okay, so we're going to be heating up the coffee first and then steam up the milk after. Um, since it's not an espresso shot per se, like exactly, um, it's not gonna go stale like a real espresso shot would go stale if we did it that step at a time. All right. Is it cold out here? He's not happy. Uh, you look really cute. <laughs> it's 
Sorry, you get less than me. Sorry. Oh, that's like amazing, like cappuccino foam. Voila. This is Ken Hawkins, Norwegian cookie, otherwise Wait, known. I thought it was King Hawkins. King Hawkins. King or Ken? You said Ken. I said Ken Hawkins. You said Ken. Is it Ken or King? Oh, <laughs> oh no! Two takes. Take Ooh, one. This is King Hawkins. This is Ken Hawkins. Depending, we'll have to look at the, the phonetics of it. <laughs> this is a cookie that my grandma would make all the time at Christmas. It is basically a Norwegian version of the Italian biscotti. Feels perfect with coffee. This is amazing coffee. If you've personally tried some different methods or coffee styles, comment below and let me know so I can check them out, try them for myself, or watch what you've already done. Or if you've heard of different coffee styles, um, contraptions, and methods, let me know. I hope you enjoyed this episode of our mocha pot coffee. Thanks for watching. I love these cookies. I just love cookies in general. Just saying. Except paleo cookies. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no point. Bueno.